Sanchez. Right. How you feel about like all this passing away so young and they prime and all that? Yeah. Feel like you was around G Money when yeah. he passed, and uh, another artist, Co Bleeder. Yeah. How you feel about that? About all and bro, it just it hurt to know that somebody that young can leave so early, man. Yeah. They don't that, but bro, like even with. Even with with, 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 with with True Bleeder, bro, like, man, bro, it, it hurt me because I'm knowing, bro, this man ain't never seen the world yet. He mm -hmm. ain't never experienced to see the world, what the world got to offer to him. And ended up being in, in, in a crossfire like that, bro, and getting hit like that. It, it hurt, bro. The same thing with G, bro, just, it, it hurt, bro. And you know what I'm saying? Even with Kwondo, like, it's just, it be senseless shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, it, it's no other way I can explain it and express myself, but to me, bro, I feel like the shit be so senseless. You know what I'm saying? When, you know what I'm saying? People don't be wanting to resolve it because they might feel like, oh, oh, this nigga pussy and all this shit like that. That's like, the main thing, pride, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Basically because of the fans. Right. You mean you beefing? Uh-huh. And uh, I'm like, man, I'm going to watch it be real. Man, fans will be like, man, that nigga pussy and all that. Yeah, shit. man. Yeah. They going to egg it on. Uh -huh. But it's up to you whether if you going to have it in your mind to where like you stronger than that or you want, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Man, I remember when I was young, like for real, and I'm an eighties baby, bro. I've been under that old law for a long time. And I remember coming up in, in they age bracket. You feel what yeah. I'm saying? I'm not gonna say I was a, a a good ass person. I was really a messed up person. But I never did no shit to where like I gotta go out there and hit a nigga up and do all that. Nah, man. I I used to fight and everything. I used to get on niggas head and used to get on my head. Mm -hmm. But I used to just, you know what I'm saying, nip it, you know what I'm saying, nip it in the bud and just soak it in and just keep on going. You know what I'm saying? What don't kill you make you stronger, bro. And that's what people gotta understand and realize, man. And and, and mo a majority of the youngsters that that's young like that, that's dying, don't be having nothing for their kids. I know and they be having kids and yeah, shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They don't be having nothing set up for their churn don't or be none of that. Set up for a funeral right now. At, at, you know what I'm saying? So you gotta lay around there and make plates and do all kind of stuff just to collect money to 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 to, to fund your funeral. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got no insurance, no nothing. You know what I'm saying? Stuff, man, what's going on with these youngsters, man? Yeah. They, you know, no insurance and all that. Yeah, bro, it's senseless, though. And they don't think about the pain they leave behind with their mouth. Yeah, and bro, they, you you leaving them to to to, to suffer. You know what I'm saying? Just grieving. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm gonna tell you something. A parent. With their child, bro, and I experienced this with myself. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. I had to take a loss with with my with my junior. You feel what I'm saying? And that's one of the hurting feeling. You know what I'm saying? That's a hurting feeling for a parent. Cause no parent wanna bury their child. They child don't no parent wanna do that. So I already know how they feel in that situation when they lose their child. Yeah. No matter. You know what I'm saying? But it's also go to say this too. Like we gotta have leaders to lead them in the right direction to know, you know what I'm saying? You know, I ain't saying not, like if it's, if, if you can lay around there and walk away from it, do that, you know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna tell you like this is, you, you gotta protect your family, your loved ones. Yeah. So I mean, we got that right to bear arms, but bear it to where like, we gotta protect what's, what we love in our household. I Man, not to get out here riding looking for that, you know what I'm saying? Cause see me, I'm the type of person, me and you get into it, I'm gonna walk away from right. the situation. Right. But but some people be like, man, that's cool shit, man. You walk away from a fight. Right. Man, I don't want to And I'm gonna tell you something, some people get in a heated moment to where like people like if, if a person like you uh, uh walk away, a person will probably feel like they'll still be trying to aid the situation on, but you really beating them mentally when you walk off from them. Yeah. When you when you walk off like that from them, you get them time to think. See when they when they when when you whoop them like that, they'll be in their mindset to where like they'll have to sit and think about it. Regardless if they feel like they up one or feeling like yeah I showed that man, you really gonna have to sit down somewhere and really think about it. And then it's gonna and it's gonna go back in your head in the back of your mind like you wrong. You know what I'm saying? Most people in Angola they doing about 20, 30 years. They probably look back at the situation. Man, like, wishing that they yeah, didn't get in that position. Uh, that thirty they second argument caused them. Yeah, a life a lifetime in prison. Ain't that mm -hmm. something, bro? Uh, one minute of your life can cause you a lifetime in prison, bro. Yeah. Just doing the wrong shit. People don't lose that pride, though, man. Man, they don't, bro. Hey, bro, I I know I know about it. Mm -hmm. I know about it, and I've been in situations to where, bro, I didn't I I I didn't I didn't lay around there and 
got into a situation to where like I'm like, damn, I wish I could have did it like this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Instead of doing it that way, you feel what I'm saying? But some people go off of reaction instead of not th instead of thinking. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I know a lot of people that that's like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, I, I hey bro, I just try to keep them in, uh, encouraged, bro. To to the ones that do want to listen to me and taking heed, bro. I tell them what I know, what I've been through, cause I ain't been living here this long like this for mm -hmm. nothing. I know I got to know something. You know what I'm saying? And still out here doing my thing, man. It's, it's more to it, you know what I'm saying? It's more to it, you feel me? So, man, if the ones that want to listen, that want to take advice or take in heed, man, if they want to talk to me, I'm down to earth. And I'm also a listener, too, because yeah. I learn, I, I can learn from a young person. Yeah, like, I ain't never too old to learn something uh -huh. from, from, from anybody that, especially if it makes sense, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Let's mm -hmm. go back to True Bleeding, man. How you think his death affected BR? Because, like, he was so talented. Was man, so talented. dog, True Bleeder, bro. Dude was going places, bro. Mm -hmm. That man was really going places, dog. Like, and I seen it in a man. And, and me and him had a good uh, bond and relationship. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Me and him uh, talked and stuff like that, bro. And uh, uh, just actually, just you know what I'm saying? Good dude, bro. Good dude. I just think that the wrong influence probably didn't, 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 didn't mess them up. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? You know, and bro, it it affect it. I know it affected a lot of people that that really loved him and really knew that he was gonna lay around there and blow yeah. it it messed with a lot of people you know what i'm saying and to hear that and him being so young that's the thing him mm. so being young man that dude was still a baby bro you feel what i'm saying and and talking grown man talk you feel what i'm saying for him to leave like that bro it just it it's crazy man it's, it's crazy